He's an open murderer! You don't like me! Oh, that's angry! <laughs> <laughs> He looks like a photo of the classic Arcadia Bay crusty fisherman. Good morning. Looks like you're ready to catch some serious fish. I wish, young gal. Arcadia Bay just isn't the same fishing town I grew up in. Has the town changed much? By Neptune's beard it has. Seems like a lifetime ago when I was king of the harbor. Your own boat. Uh, you do good, how about your own You boat? have your own boat? I call her the Bali High. I've kept a hold of her in these lean days. It might be all the time we've got left. I thought one of Arcadia Bay's main exports was fish. Oh, the fish used to jump onto my boat until the Prescotts and their finance fiends snapped up harbor rights. Oh. Uh, yeah, so they own this town. The Prescotts have a lot of power. They might rename the town Prescott Bay. If that tells you much. Tells me he's a douche. Um, they own my school. Yeah. They own my school. Crooks gain respect when they put their names on schools and libraries. Let's not get downcast. I hear the fish calling for Bali High. Never forget that old fishermen never die. We just smell that way. I'd love to learn more, but I have to get going. Happy fishing out there. All right. Um, how are you, sir? Snow. Well, that's a good start to the story. Newspapers are going to be retro soon. Excuse me, sir? Can you believe this town? The world is on fire, and our big headline is snow. I can hardly wait for next week's big story. Clouds! Hm. This snow was odd. How long have you lived here? How long have you lived here? How long have you lived here? Long enough to know that Arcadia Bay will be a ghost town in a few years. I keep reading how Arcadia Bay is booming. The paper can only talk about that, or about missing girls. You mean Rachel Amber? I guess. I bet she ran away because she was bored. Who wouldn't be here? Yeah. Homeless guy. Hi, homeless. Poor woman. I hope it's a shelter for her. Hello. Oh, look at you. A fine example of youth. I bet you're a senior student. Yes, I go to Blackwell Academy. I could tell you're a wise young woman. I know all about Blackwell and this town. Do tell. Um. I'm gonna say Prescott. I bet you have dirt on the Prescott family. That whole family is dirty. They once done good things for Arcadia Bay. Those days are dead. Lack like anything in their way. I know somebody who's being threatened by a Prescott. Then you be their guardian angel, because nothing gets in the way of that family, especially not the law. Hell, they own your school, Blackwell. It. Almost. You must know Joyce Price from the Two Whales Diner. She's fed me more than my own family. How's a daughter your age who's always in trouble? Married to a real prick. Have you met Joyce's daughter? Cute girl. Pissed off. I used to see her and her pretty friend, uh, Rachel, around a lot. Do you know anything about Rachel Amber, that missing girl? I know she's missing, and I know she hung out here a bit. Sometimes I'd see her walking, all by herself, deep in thought. Too damn young and pretty to look so worried. So she looked a 
worry. Did you talk to her? Was she alone? Yeah, she said she was alone. Did you talk to her? Once or twice she'd talk to me about trouble in school, wanting to be some model in California. She was always distant, but nice. I pray the poor thing is all right, but you can't save everybody. Mm. That is true. How long have you lived in Arcadia Bay? A thousand years. I've gone through the same changes as the town. Hmm. What happened? What changes? What changes to the town? Once it takes a lifetime to see. There's a lot of beauty here, but a lot of darkness too. Greedy bastards that ruin this town put people out of work. Out of home. Like me. I'm sorry. Have you ever lived outside of here? Where the hell would I go? I hate the sun and love the mist. I might be homeless, but Arcadia Bay is still my home. I have to go now. Goodbye. Hmm. All right. So, we found out information that if I hadn't actually gone around here, it might not have been all that useful, but... Ooh, what the fuck? Ooh, I can a photo! Yeah! I don't know who that is, but... We're a creepy old dude. Hmm. That van looked familiar, supposedly. Alright. I'm coming close. Sorry for the wait. Probably wait. smell of breakfast and the sound of clanging silverware mm, makes me feel 13 again. Justin is such a mellow dude. Trevor looks as happy as Dana did. What's up, Justin? Getting my coffee on before I cut class and destroy some rails. Shouldn't you be taking photos? I am always taking photos. I am a camera. You crack me up, Maxter. Of course I'm baked, so I'll laugh at anything. You should be studying, <laughs> bad boy. So where's all your homework, schoolgirl? School? Speaking of buds, I saw your bro Trevor sneaking out of Dana's room. Trevor finally told me about him and Dana hooking up. He got there first, so I snooze and I lose. See you later, Max. All right. Him like an eye, dude. Fisherman. These fishermen are so damn quiet. Did you catch any big ones today? If by big you mean none, then sure. I caught a lot of big ones today. Now let me mourn over my eggs. Aw, I'm sorry, dude. Weird lady. I always wonder what people think about when they eat alone. Let's do it. Hello there to you! Such a beautiful day, eh? Oh yeah, it's gonna be a super day. Enjoy your breakfast, eh? She's Canadian! And they think that's weird. Okay, that's just wrong. Well, I'm gonna be on my way, eh? Okay, I'm sorry, I should have done that. Um... This guy has serious cojones. Oh, my God, let's jump that stereotype. Oh man, I bet that's the same gum from when I was here last. Yeah, probably. That's normally how it is. Uh, what's this? I might make Chloe check this out with me. <laughs> Sasquatch. The poster doesn't mention whacked students with guns. Can't imagine why. Um, Kate Marsh, love you long time. I am too misbehaved, okay? Um, Curtia Gay sucks back. 
lovely. Great spelling. Thank you, redneck poet. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha